The moon beat down on the moonlight earth as the two armies drew closer, each step sending plumes of dust into the air. The lizard men, led by the fearsome Saurus Old Blood K.R.O. Kugar, advanced steadily. Their ranks bolstered by towering beasts such as Carnosaurs and Stegodons. They were a force to be reckoned with, their scales glinting in the sunlight as they approached. On the other side of the plain stood the Chaos Dwarfs, a twisted and malevolent race of beings who had long ago turned to dark magic and engineering to further their goals. Led by the sorcerer Zarnagrand, they had come to crush their enemies beneath their iron boots. They stood atop massive war machines, their dark eyes gleaming with malice as they waited for the battle to begin. The two armies clashed with a deafening roar, the lizard men charging forward with their spears and shields. The chaos dwarfs firing volleys of rockets and bolts. was brutal and chaotic, with blood and carnage littering the ground. The Carnosaurs tore through the ranks of the Chaos Dwarfs, their massive jaws crushing their foes, but were met with deadly fire from the war machines. The pterodons swooped down to attack, but were met with blasts of dark magic that sent them crashing to the ground. Despite their ferocity, the lizard men found themselves struggling against the cunning and technology of the Chaos Dwarfs. Zarnagran's dark magic wreaked havoc on their lines, turning warriors to stone and summoning twisted demons to rip them apart. The Chaos Dwarf's artillery was devastating, with war machines such as the Hell Cannon and the Death Shrieker raining destruction on their foes.
KROQ Gar fought fiercely, cleaving through the Chaos Dwarf ranks with his axe, but even he could not turn the tide of battle. The lizard men were pushed back, their lines breaking under the relentless assault of the Chaos Dwarfs. Desperate to turn the tide, K.R.O. Kugar called upon the power of the Old Ones channeling the raw energy of the universe into a massive blast of light. The Chaos Dwarfs were caught off guard their war machines and sorcery shattered by the sheer force of the blast. For a moment, it seemed as though the lizard men might snatch victory from the jaws of defeat. But Zarnagran was not so easily defeated. With a sneer of contempt, he unleashed a devastating spell that caused a massive explosion, wiping out an entire unit of Saurus warriors. The lizard men were thrown into disarray their morale shattered by the sheer power of the sorcerer's magic. As the sun began to set on the battlefield, the Chaos Dwarfs emerged victorious. Their twisted faces twisted into cruel grins, they celebrated their triumph. Knowing that they had proven once again that their mastery of dark magic and technology was unmatched on the battlefield. The lizard men retreated, licking their wounds and mourning their dead. The memory of the battle a testament to the ferocity and brutality of war.
But the story does not end there. For even as the Chaos Dwarfs savored their victory, a dark presence stirred in the shadows. In the heart of the Dark Lands, a horde of Skaven plotted and schemed. They had watched the battle with interest knowing that the victor would be weakened and vulnerable. Now, they saw an opportunity to strike. The Skaven were a race of rat-like creatures who had long dwelt beneath the earth plotting and scheming in.